and welcome back to Stuff We Do, where we do all the knife stuff you love. Knife reviews, knife tests, knife modifications, and outdoor stuff with knives. Today we are talking CRKT, confidence in hand. <laughs> okay. Um, oh, we're still doing knife maintenance. Never mind. So you weren't expecting a knife, right? You were expecting something else. And I love this thing. This thing is not new. It's been around for quite a while, but it's the first time I've seen it. Let's just see what awesomeness they tell us in here. Okay, there we see a guy making fire. We see a knife, M16, quite iconic knife. Well, for CRKT at least. Okay, um, not really content specific. And then we have this thing. What might this thing be? Okay, this is a magnet. Okay, so it's aluminum, but I can feel something metal in there. And then what on earth might this weird doorknob looking thing be? Pow! Magnetically closes quite nicely. And then if you open it, we have wonderful Weeha bits. Okay, so this is supposedly a bit better than the normal nonsense I use. Because I tend to buy the cheapest ones and just lots of them. So we have a 7, 8. Let's just check if that's a 6. What is that? Okay, I don't have my spectacles on. I think that's a 6. Okay, 6, 7, 8... Is this going to be a 9? Is this going to be a 9? Does that say 9? Oh, it says the name. We are. 15. Okay. And then this one. Then. And. Can we see the nine? Okay, fantastic. So we have six up to ten and then a fifteen. Now this should work perfectly for all your knifey needs in the world. Um let's just quickly check what is this the cogent? It has an eight pivot, so we take out an eight. Yes, I should really wear my spectacles when doing these types of things because I cannot well let's just feel it. Okay, perfect. That fits in there, so I suppose it's eight. And then you just pop it in there, and you can just pop that thing back. And now you have a perfectly functional little Torx driver. This is like fumbling around blind. I cannot see anything. Okay, so there we go. Beautiful, and you can put quite a lot of torque on this thing because it is quite big. Okay, I don't want to change that because that thing is perfect. Still, I love this thing, the cogent. And then as I fail it while, as I fail it while, as I fail it while flipping it. Okay, so that's why it has a flipper for when you, okay, something feels. Okay, anyway, we are talking about knife maintenance. So maybe we should lube up a few things also. Okay, but we were actually talking about this thing. So I actually quite like this thing. So you can take out the thing, put in a different bit, take out that bit, bit it in there, put that thing on the back. And look at that. Isn't that just a nice compact little unit covering all your needs? It is CRA KT. This thing is made out of some kind of super fancy aluminum. It looks pretty cool. Um, they, in the description, I will have all the details. They say something about, um, I don't know, very resistant to whatnot. Oh, and you can even, you know, when the when you hold the cap, um, the butt part, and you turn the thing, you can even do that because the butt part will turn. Um, but you don't need that. And the gnarling on this thing is gnarly, so you can really get a grip on this. So I quite dig this thing. Now, instead of having my 10 tools that I always use, or when I need two of the same things, I use the little thing you get with your honey badgers. You know that 
what do you call it, Allen key looking little Torx bit with a screwdriver. Now this is going to help me sort all of that out. I suppose you can't carry that thing in front, but I like it like this. And then you can just put it somewhere and you have your own little toolbox with you. Okay, so that is the CRKT bit driver. The name will be there and the subscribe button will be there and yes thank you very much for watching if you're new it's normally way better than this this is like my worst video ever if you've been here for a while yeah this is pretty much as good as it gets enjoy your weekend a lot be good to your mothers if you live in south africa because sunday is mother's day and stay safe happy and have a good one goodbye Thank you.